we have done the alteration. You know, the law talks about either amend or alter. To amend means to improve what we have, and to alter is to replace without necessarily changing the form. So you know that we had only one issue, which is the, the, the subscription of somebody called Richard Asina. It was said that he did it for uh, the candidates in Jasikam, or Buem Jasikam district, and did it at lower, lower Eman Dentra or something in the central region. Now the law doesn't say that one person can endorse, you know, in different, you know, districts. It ought to be in only one district. So, what we have done is to replace the Richard Asida with someone else, and to replace the person who also signed in the lower Emma Dentra with another person. So we've done a complete alteration by giving them two different subscriptions. The Richard Asida is no longer on our forms. It changes for all those things that they felt they have seen. They, in their view, these were concerns that they wanted to raise. <coughs> but our people will look at it if within the period there is anything that could be done fine. If not, we strictly, we had one issue Richard Asida we went to high court, they challenged it at the Supreme Court. We won again, they said, go, let him do it. You were all, you were not in the courtroom, but when they gave us today, five o'clock, I told the judges that I felt it was, you know, a, a little bit too straight and narrow, if they could make it Wednesday. And they said, hey, is your issue not only one? Mm -hmm. So why? Cry your own cry. And everybody was laughing in the room. Mm -hmm. So everybody understood that we had only one issue to deal with. So these other issues that were raised, you know, were in the view of the commission drawing our attention should we want to look at it. So, so in the view of the commission, perhaps there wouldn't be a grounds for a disqualification. I don't know. As far as I know, I said we were dealing with one. So does it mean that we have completed that one? They are saying that it was wrong for us to even. That is my people to have gone to the press because the impression created out there was that they were insisting and that they are not. This is their recorder. They recorded me when I'm, I was inside. They are recording it here. And I'm repeating it. They said we even owe them an apology because they never insisted that we should go and correct whatever discrepancies they said they had seen. They were interested in we producing Asida to come and own up to which of the signatures is his. And we have done that. You can ask the recorder. We send him in there. They have seen him. They've asked him questions. He has signed a specimen signature. He has owned up that. He doesn't know anybody called, any place called Lower Ima Dintra. He lives in Buem, in the Jasikan district. It's got nothing to do with whatever happened at that in the central region. So, because of by implication, doesn't mean that your nominations have been accepted and your candidate or your clients will be part of the 2016 presidential elections. If we are going according to the law and what the Supreme Court said, I think that should be the issue. That's, you see, if you look at the law, what it says is that no returning officer has a right to to disqualify anybody. The duty of the returning officer is to draw attention of the candidates to anomalies and to afford the candidate the opportunity to go and either amend or alter. Only when that candidate refuses to do that, that the returning officer shall then endorse it and refer the matter to the commission, for the commission within seven days to take a decision on the matter. This is why we kept saying that the nomination day should be different from the nomination period. You cannot set a nomination day and call that a nomination period. What happens when the person 
brings back the corrected form. The law imposes a seven-day duty on you. When will that seven-day kick in? When will it start? You have seven days within which to take a decision. So, for purposes of presidential elections, the chairperson of the commission is the um, returning officer. A duty, if she has found something, I said it is Richard Asida. She has told us. We have dealt with that one. We have come and changed the person, altered that person completely. It means we are finished. There is nothing again to refer to the commission, in my view. Because you said, Richard Asida, we have come to alter him. Okay, Officially, did but, she tell you that they have accepted your nominations and, yes. your, and your presentation? I don't know what you want me to tell you. I'm saying that. In terms of the law, a duty is to draw our attention to anomaly he finds and give us the opportunity to go and alter and amend. It is when we don't do that that he endorses and refers the matter, which means that when you do that, that ends the matter.